Because the universe always agrees with you. Think about that. If the universe always agrees with you, what have you created to date? We often create from our lack. And that's why I want to help you to plant new seeds. Okay, so left hand on heart, right hand on abdomen, thumb in line with navel. <sighs> Deep breaths to ground and center. Feel yourself sinking down and down to a relaxed state. Feel that the breath is relaxed. So you're not forcing the breath, it's just a gentle inward and outward breath. I'd like you to stroke your arms, your chest, your abdomen, your back. Stroking in downward movements, down the legs, down to the feet. Feeling your healthy body in your hands, feeling your connection to this skin suit that you're in. Eyelids are heavy. Sitting bones sinking down deeper and deeper as you are being supported by the chair that you are in. Command in your mind, I am grounded now. As you feel your connection to the core of the earth, feel the energy gates and the soles of the feet illuminate. Now illuminate the palms and the crown, the five gateways, activating you as the five-pointed star that you are. As you're breathing, you're squeezing into your perineum and abdomen, bringing in those lots of your tongue resting on the roof of the mouth behind the two front teeth. Feel that you are protected. Feel that you're filling yourself up with vital life force energy. And now disconnect from all the things that are causing that vital life force energy to be leaked, drained from you, harvested. So you disconnect from all discordance, from negative thoughts, through to feeling depressed, suppressed, agitated, anything out of alignment, any spells, blocks, seals, releasing from them now. And now proclaim, I am free and sovereign. I co-create my world through all my choices. It is time to choose joy. It is time that I ignite my life to create my new life. I am now becoming aware of all the times I thwart my full potential through my own resistance. I now realize that any negative thought to do with me that activates self-doubt or fear is my resistance in my life. This is what causes my difficulties, problems and diseases and challenges. I choose to free myself from these thoughts now. For these thoughts are not true. I know anything is possible. 
I know that I can do anything at any time. Because I am sovereign. Focus now back on my health, my physical health. I'm unzipping a skin suit that doesn't suit me and in my mind, putting on a new skin suit that is perfectly healthy. Because everything is mental and I choose my life. And now I look at my emotional health. My emotional health is indicative of my mental health. Whatever is in my thoughts creates feelings. I take full responsibility for my thoughts and feelings now. Because thoughts and feelings are not real. Thoughts can stem from false beliefs. Anything limiting my potential is a false belief. My energy in motion, emotions, follow my thoughts. I now observe my emotions and where they sit on the emotional guidance system. My emotions create an energy signature that call to me more things that cause this emotion. I know that by changing my thoughts, it will change my feelings and I will magnetize to me a happier, healthier me, physically, mentally, emotionally. So now I choose to be the observer. And now I choose joy because I am choosing my new life. And I breathe in new beginnings and new potentials with every breath that I take. And I breathe out the old ways that no longer serve me. I have the power to think beyond my current circumstances and conditions. And now it is time for me to delve deep, to transform, to reform, to mold, to sculpt my life, for I co-create through my choices every moment. So I ask myself, what would I love right now? What is the fertility journey that I would love right now? I ask my visions to flow clearly and may they be visions that make my heart sing for then I know it is my goal no one else's and as I envisage this I remind myself 
that I can think beyond the circumstances and conditions. Nothing limits me.